Hello and welcome to this CN Creator presentation. The CN Creator is a tool where you can search for suitable environments, objects, and build an interactive 3D simulation that you can then share in a multi user environment for uh, training, education, and any presentation purposes. First thing I'm doing here is I'm searching for a classroom object and I selected one of the two that was found. I can then preview the environment and uh, lock the room into a specific location in case I have multiple rooms. Then I will select some objects and here I selected a DNA a molecule and I found one option here. I position it inside the room and I can scale it. Uh, you can do basic manipulations and if you've created this object in Eon Studio or Eon Professional it will carry over those interactions as we'll see later. Next I'm going to go over and find some other objects and here I search for a uh, human heart anatomy. Uh, out of the three options I picked one with a section in this case First thing I'm doing is scaling the object to a relative scale that I would like to have and then I can position it within the space. Uh, I can of course select many different objects and combine the environment any way uh, that I want to do. Uh, at this point uh, I'll show some of the other features like uh, how you can navigate and interact with the various objects. Uh, there's two main navigation modes, Orbit and Walk. And then finally I'm going to add the Coliseum multi-user components. And the first thing I'll do here is I'm going to select a couple of uh, camera positions and maybe we'll start with one from the back of the classroom. And shortly I'll save that location. And you'll see later on how we use these for a couple of different purposes. Okay. Now when I've done that, uh, maybe I want to have a, another viewpoint from the, the front of the classroom, from the teacher's position. So all I do, I navigate up to the uh, teacher's desk and position the camera exactly where I want it. And then I save that position. Finally, we will be adding a couple of uh, uh, presentation screens so in addition to this environment that I now have configured and I can search the web for thousands of environments and objects I'm going to add some screens here to do specific object presentations. This will be used in Colosseum later on. I'm going to add a, a document presentation screen. That one will use for PowerPoints and then I can add other screens for sharing multimedia, video, etc. Now I'm pretty much ready with the room configuration and the Eon Creator portion. So all I need to do is save my environment file. And after that's done, we're going to go over to the Colosseum uh, portion of the presentation. I'll also select a thumbnail and a short, uh, add a short description for this uh, particular simulation that I developed. So we'll call it Classroom uh, DNA and Heart. So I can remember and find the correct one later on. Now we're over in the Colosseum environment and I simply click Import Room. And I, I uh, select the room that we just created. And then the next step, and this is typical for any Colosseum, simulation I can select the few interactive objects that will then show up on the on the panel that I added to the front of the classroom and uh, we'll select the, just a couple of different here and then I can select uh, or import a video or select and import a uh, PowerPoint presentation or document. I'll add a little description so I can store this on the Colosseum server then we'll start the meeting select an avatar and voila, we are inside our newly created uh, environment. Uh, one of the beauties with the Creator is that it's something that you can learn in minutes and you can totally customize 
and set up a teaching experience, whether it's on the desktop or in an immersive environment with a stereoscopic projector or a fully immersive environment like an iCube if you have uh, access to that holodeck type uh, display device. Uh, you can also connect uh, easily up to 30 people in a simulation. You can control it as a teacher or you can have a, a more interactive, explorative simulation where the students can explore themselves. Besides the interactive objects that we showed here, you can also do, of course, the presentations, videos and other media. Thank you very much.